Yo, what is going on YouTube? It is OG and today we are back on the spike push. So we're a few games off of 1900 right now. Oh my god, we just got a game. Okay, I was hoping to do a longer intro, but I guess I guess not. Um we're gonna be doing curveball spike today just because I know it's curveball. I, I always know I'm a hypocrite. But um just because you guys will see in a sec, obviously it's undermined, so the lands are just a mess and oh my god. Um we just really need to be careful and play passive here. So Bobby's gonna tap Sandy, that should, as long as, okay, so you can see like, I just kinda have to guess where they are until they're out of vision. Um, if I had fertilizer, I couldn't do that, so. That's gonna be the only reason why I'm playing Curveball. Curveball definitely has a place for Spike, in my opinion. In longer range matchups, you want the poke. <clears throat> or when there's a lot of grass. Like this, just uh, because it's harder to predict, right? The main pattern of Spike is usually very easy, and I think I can get the Sandy here, hopefully. So it's gonna connect you can see I think we have a bit of delay here. I'm not sure we've we've been playing against Russians So yeah, you can see I have like a good amount of delay when I throw the spike um, It's a, a little unlucky, but we're playing curveball. So accuracy doesn't matter as much I'm gonna get a pretty oh, please don't go down Okay, so that would have been really bad if we went down because he could have flanked Bobby But luckily we're able to take him out and now we just kind of have to like hold our position Alec and Bobby both did a really good job on their lanes and mid that game um, So as long as I took care of the Sandy there's not really any threat. Everyone kind of did their job. We'll take out the Sandy one more time and we're gonna take that game and I can finish my intro. <laughs> All right guys, so back to the intro. Um, that caught me really off guard. That was fast and then that was like 15 minutes. That, fast for us. Um, two games off, 1900, we're gonna get it live. Um, and yeah, enjoyed the video. <laughs> All right guys, we're back. Um, sorry, I had to close daily dose of internet. Let's see if we have delay this game. Okay, yeah, I do have delay. That's kind of toxic. I guess we're still on EU servers or something. I don't know. Um, I got into the game a little late, so I do have Mort lane. That's gonna be tough. I think I'm just gonna pinch over on the Gale because he's like way too far up. I missed my shot. I can get him, maybe. Okay, Bobby's gonna have to gadget that. Um, I guess he didn't have any gems and wanted to save his gadget. Oh, this delay is kind of annoying, I'm not gonna lie, but we have curveball spike, so luckily we don't have to hit our shots. I want to keep the more from regenerating. I missed. I'm gonna jump that in, maybe. I gotta pinch over on Gale. We can get Gale out right now. My oh, nice pull, Bobby. Good pull from Bobby. Um, I have to gadget that one. I think he should have gadgeted that. I don't know why he's not gadgeting. He's kind of being stingy with his gadget. He did have five gems there um okay we really need to get we we just got a crowd mid at this point because anything that spawns he can just do that i caught him though nice okay that's really big i think we just won because of that okay time to just gadget and hope for the best bobby run bobby please have gadgets no so the mort threw really hard he got greedy um it's best to just wait as you guys can see um, they had 9-0 against us, and he just didn't want to wait, so he went for that gem, and it didn't go too well. But we'll take that game, and we're one game off 1900. Alright guys, we are back at it with our third game of the video. Let's delay check. Yeah, I think we still have a bit. Yeah, we had some delay, but it feels, even the walking, I can notice a difference from last game. So we got Sandy Lane, gonna have to poke him down a little bit. Oh, did Bobby get three taps? But what's going on in mid there? Um, so Alec is going to oh, I have no idea where the sandy is. This is why I have curveball though See if I had the other Fertilizer star power that would have never hit so I'm assuming he just ran <laughs> He has his gadget though. Okay. He's at the back. Did he gadget? I think he gadgeted but um Okay, I recognize these players Th these guys are Russian. So we're definitely not on NA servers um, We've been on EU servers all day. It's kind of toxic, but we haven't lost yet so not really the best <sighs> can i get two shots i think if i don't have delay i kill him there like that was so close um but as long as i can keep him out of the grass like it's fine i think i still got him right here probably yeah bobby's gonna go over and get him but i think i had him and i'm just gonna go i'll get a few shots off on their turret and i feel like the penny's kind of close so i do want to save my shots for the sandy just because he can be oh no oh no Look at that range on the turret. That didn't hit me, but that's ridiculous. Bobby, hit him once, please. We are just gonna go. We don't want him to regen. Nice, we're gonna get him. And I'm gonna make a play here. Hopefully he goes for it. Yeah, we trap his exit, and then we can take him out, and we'll just 
Super those were red barring. Oh, okay, that was that was kind of close. Bobby can grab those now though. Gene used pull, um, and then he's gonna get a good pull on the penny. I don't know how he died at first with the penny. That it, like he, it looked like he got like three or four tapped by it. So, but to be fair, we are on EU servers, um, so it's kind of tough. You can see like the delay, like just like it's there, it's visible. But we got the dub. All right, guys, we are back at it. Delay truck still there. Still laggy, that's okay. Um, wait, okay. So I think Bobby, their comp is super meta. Uh, we kind of had a weird strat. I don't know why Bobby went mid though. It kind of threw me off a little bit. And for my lane, I'm gonna make sure we get under those shots. Fortunately, we don't, and kind of trading with him pretty decently. Can I get him here? I got him. Ah, that's so unlucky that hit. Um, it's okay though, because I don't think he got Porter off that. He's probably like one hit off Porter. Um, but I can get back to playing the same time as him. Oh no, he doesn't. Porter. Oh, that range. Mr. P is so toxic. I got to regen and just save my shots up here. So if Alec goes on the Mr. P, it's definitely our best matchup. But luckily, I 2 k that. I can get him. But he has another one ready. Um, so I'm not going to do too much. So. Nice pull from Bobby, and we can get the Mr. P here. No, we can't. This delay, like, ah, uh, it's. I don't know if you guys can tell by how I'm shooting, but we're on EU servers, I think, or something. I don't know. Uh, just, uh, I overextended there. Alec, don't get pulled, please. I think we just kind of group up mid. Don't stand too close together, and just watch out for the car. Maybe I'll just go up here. I'm gonna like put some pressure that way we get the Tara nice we got the Tara that's really big Bobby's gonna hit the pull nice really good play um good coordination from us I'm just gonna play high because the Tara does have pull and spike hard counters Tara as long as it's like this um so I'm just gonna like make sure she's their only win condition right now I mean Gene does have pull too but I can block that a lot easier um so I'll just stand in front of Bobby he's gonna have to pull me if he wants to pull anyone and we'll take the game nice Alright guys, so uh, Bobby had to go, um, just for the sake of recording, I wanted some variety, that's why it is a replay. So last night we were playing Hot Potato, it's a little unorthodox for our comp, and you can see just why. So the meta here, it's really like Gale and Bull, or like Daryl, and they just jump in. It's so hard to do it, so really I'm like our damage dealer, and I have to know when to go up and trade, because I'm also the best at taking out uh, the Bull and the Gale, well... The gale we can all kind of like deal with a little bit so we gotta like i have to hold this high position and just zone them off so it's really important for me to just really like just stay aggressive here and just kind of get poked down on the safe as well so you can see i'm gonna try tripping the jump pad too when they get close just um all right i don't do it right there but the idea is just so um they can't have the jump pad when they want it even though it's like a short cooldown but right there i'll trade and you can see it's even and they've had zero control this entire game they literally just jump in and it's so hard to defend it so we need to really like maximize on our offense right here you can see he decides not to use the jump pad and we all just kind of collapse on them he does get like one shot off i think and you can just see how much damage gale does gale's so strong right now you should not be hitting 17s consistently from distance I think here we do a lot of damage, so I'm gonna like just pop my gadget just to apply pressure. Bobby's doing a good job supporting me with the heal, and I'm gonna switch sides. So I prefer the right side, but it doesn't really matter at the end of the day, as long as we can get like some work done on the safe. And we're in a really good spot, we just gotta keep them out of our end, and I'm just gonna get some free shots on the safe. So one super, and it is down, but I think I get pinched really hard here. So it's game. this game's actually really close because they did get control there, so Bobby's gotta hit a pull here, hopefully. Um, they only have 2% on the safe, so any of us can really take it out. So it looks like we're in a really good spot right now. Alex just gonna go for it. Bobby's there to finish it off though, and that's gonna be game number one of Heist. All right, guys. So here is another example of that comp. Uh, so this is the Daryl variation, and it is really good as well too. Um, they also have Max, which is just a pain to deal with. So strong right now. Uh, so their comp is super meta and you know ours is a little unorthodox but you can see the Daryl going in I know I have to trade so you can just see um, I want to get those three shots off every time at least and then just kind of get position because getting position is so important for our comp and just holding it staying aggro so I'm going to try chipping uh, their Daryl down but he is going to get a roll off on safe and 
you know, they will have the damage lead. But I'm doing a decent job just chipping. It's hard. Alex going to get up in position too. Um, and with our comp, we really have to play well as a team, I feel like. Bobby is definitely our main defender just because Gene doesn't do too well. So the Daryl is going to go down there. I think he should have gone on me. Bobby's going to pull Max and just keep me alive. So really good job from Bobby just holding down mid. Um, and you can see he's kind of like got rid of all the grass. Unfortunately, I do get run down by the Daryl there and you're gonna get a lot of uh, pressure because of that Bobby's gonna do a really good gadget use and that's gonna enable me to take out the max I'll also take out the Daryl and it's all about like two of us kind of defending unless we can get me and Alec in the high spot um, And then the other ones just like training damage so we don't fall behind because it's so easy for them to engage on us um, Compared to our engage. We're all like not very like tanky um we don't have a jump pad you know the jump pad does help they have max super as well so at this point um alex is just gonna go in on the safe and it's gonna be really close it's pretty much a base race at this point and we are gonna defend alex is gonna go down too so it is really close we got to be careful of the daryl jumping in bobby hits a really good pull on uh the daryl right when the jump pad was taking off that might have saved the game i don't know uh but it was a really good pull i feel like he aimed that one too props to bobby and you can see the max got on our safe um and alex just there to finish it off though all right guys so this is gonna be the last game of the video and we have the same comp again so i'd say we played like gale like tank probably like 50 percent of the time so we did kind of have like a strategy and you can see they all use the same exact strategy as well um but it's really tough to play against and it's just if we don't have perfect defense you know it's gonna be really tough but bobby's doing a really good job just you can see he popped the gadget there too and he does manage to stay alive so then we're all able to collapse on the daryl but daryl just one shots me um and bobby is just managing to hang on fortunately the daryl does get a max shot off on safe so that's gonna hurt a lot alex's gonna go in but gail gets his super so he can just push him back like that but he does end up winning the trade and i'm just gonna try getting as much damage on the daryl before he jumps just to make it easier for bobby um and thank you for the bits i'm streaming by the way guys <laughs> so i'm ignoring my chat for you guys you better youtube you better appreciate it um and you can see bobby's gonna hit a really good pull on the daryl as well and daryl rolls in but bobby's able to win that so now i finally get into my little corner and i do want to take out the gale first just because it's a threat and it makes it easier on defense as well so <sighs> Camera's kind of going wild right now. Um, Alec and Bobby are going to be there to clean up on defense. So Alec hitting that one shot really helps out Bobby just because Gene's reload speed's pretty slow and Daryl's super tanky. Um, but now we're in a really good spot and I'm kind of playing like Ring Around the Rosie with the Brock. So I just want to stay alive. Alec gets his super off on safe with Gadget. So it's just a ton of damage. But on the other end of things, they do have the Daryl kind of on their safe, our safe. But we're able to finish off and take the dub. Alright guys, that is going to be it for today's video. So I know you guys prefer the live gameplay, but just for the sake of recording, I wanted some variety. So we got the heist games in too. I felt like the heist was really cool and it's just like different uh, from our typical gem grab, which you, we've kind of been spamming this push. I'm not going to lie, gem grab seems to be the safest overall. Xfinity, thank you for the 100 bits. He says, don't forget to subscribe, so subscribe. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it for today's video. Appreciate you all and I'll see you all tomorrow. Peace.